now if you have a small account or you're looking forward to grow your trading account i'm going to show you guys four easy steps that you can use to do just that now for these four different steps i'm going to show you guys an app that can help you be efficient with it now the first problem we're going to tackle here is meta trader 4. now i never realized that meta trader 4 was just a limiting app until i had to try something different now i just downloaded this app recently and i had to go through it i had to study the ins and out of this app like the functionalities now i've used mt5 in the past but as of that time these features were not available so it's due to the reset update that they added all this thing so if you already have mt5 you can go ahead and update the app because because if you don't update it you won't see the things i'm about to show you right now now let me show you guys something different about mt5 in comparison with mt4 now one thing different about mt5 is that you can do all of your trading right on the chat section now let's say if i want to place a trade i can just tap this section right here and it brings out the stuff out now today is saturday so you can't place by yourself the market is closed now the best part about this is that if i'm watching the market and i really need to place a buy immediately i could just tap this point and go in buy you can go ahead and set in your lot size you can put maybe nine lot size and press buy and then your tree just goes in like when i found out about this this was like jeez i've been stressing myself all through now the part that really got me surprised about this app is this section right here now do you know that you can set in buy limit sell limits order by just dropping something like this just by doing like this and the best part of this is that you can just set your take profit and stop loss just like that so I could easily set a stop loss just by moving it like this and yeah i can go ahead and set a take profit like this and your take profit is already set your take profit is already set or like mt4 that you start cramming in the numbers okay it's 1.2265 and it'd be like take profit at this point 2265 whatever that's the burn power of trading you could just easily set your take profit and your stop loss like this and once you hit this section go ahead and place in your trade although the market is not open and also let me see if there's a point you really just wanted to like adjust your stop loss you could just do this thing that i just showed you now in summary what this mt5 app helps you to do is to make trading less stressful like you can see how this minor things this minor these little things could easily go a long way when you're actually going ahead to buy or sell or you want to make that quick you know quick position or you want to adjust one thing or the other instead of like trying to cram this thing or trying to write it down and put it you can just swipe swipe something here you've changed stop loss you've changed stock profit this is really really crazy so so definitely this app should also be your option now i'm kind of used to mt4 so i might use mt4 as well as using mt5 so i'll be using both of them you know, here and there now for the second part is actually in terms of your strategy now in terms of your strategy and making analysis in general the best app for this is trading view trading view is just like the one-stop shop that if you want to make your analysis this is actually the best app for it now when i see their chats is very very sophisticated i'm not joking now let's say if we don't want to use like this normal candlestick you can go ahead and change the candlestick to something that we like so you can go ahead and change the candlestick to there's hello candles there's high kanashi there's renko now on trading view there are actually a lot of different type of candlestick that i can use and understand the market now if you go to meta trader there's only like a limited option of candlestick you can see right here light charts candlestick bar charts but on trading view we have bar charts hello candles columns line area baseline you can see you can see all of them and the best one high kanashi candlestick which makes everything so much more easier to understand but on meta for we just have this ones now let's say i were to like backtest my strategy and every other thing i want to test it in the live market now do you know that there is an option where you can go back in time and completely erase what is at this side of the market so let's say we want to backtest our strategy we can just come into this part right here and put bar replay now we can go ahead and cut this part of the market and when we cut this part of the market it will no longer be available i could just tap into this section and this whole part disappears and and i can just go ahead and backtest my strategy whatever indicator i want to use and i can just go ahead and play everything 
and see how it works with whatever strategy i'm testing which is very very helpful these these free games right here now the best part of this is that there are actually a lot of indicators that are right here from indicators to strategies that are already formed together to profiles to pattern and lots more like this is actually fully packed to compare to meta Terraform. so if you want to do your analysis i recommend you just go for or stick to trading view now the third one is vantage market now in case you don't know vantage market is a regulated broker now the only way you can trade the forex market is with vantage markets which is the broker now some people don't know that the assets that your broker have is what you're only going to trade now vantage markets have to get everything all round so you don't get limited so if someday you feel like trading indices can just come to the indices section and you know look for what you trade on there commodities section and also share section apple facebook netflix at t um verizon all those brands that you know can also go ahead and trade them with vantage market so for you to be able to get this you need to go to the description of this video and click on the vantage market link so you can go ahead and have a trading account with vantage market now for the the next app i'm going to be talking about is basically on risk management what you can do is to go to this app called fx calculators now let's say for example i have 500 dollars and the amount i want to risk in a particular trade is just like 10 dollar 12 dollar on that account this is the only amount i want to risk now what i'm going to do is that i'm going to come into this position size right here now it asks me some certain questions to give me like that right lot size to use and the amount of pips that i'm going to set it to so the first question is it actually is like your account currency so you go ahead and stay it out now the financial instruments you want to trade you go ahead and select the financial instruments you want to trade and let's say i want to, say, I want to trade gppsd go ahead and put in your account side let's say it's 500 dollar account and the amount i want to risk now the amount you want to risk is in dollar value so let's say i just want to risk only 10 dollars now it now access you the stop loss in pips now at this point you cannot go to the market and find out where those key levels are and find out how many pip that key level is now once you've already found out how many pip that key level is i now go ahead and type in that key level the pip for that point is like 26 pips now once you've done this it will go ahead and give you the lot size you can use to place that trade with that you're not risking more than that dollar amount that you don't want to risk in the market but what you're going to be picking right here is the standard lot section you don't need to look at the mini micro lot section now if you did find value in this video make sure you go ahead and hit the like button if you're not a part of the family make sure you go ahead and hit the red subscribe button and with that being said I'll see you guys in the next one peace out